Hey guys, welcome to the backyard quarantine workout number one. It's Wednesday and tonight as of midnight we'll all be stuck inside and I don't know about you guys but I don't have a gym set up at home so I'm going to take you guys through some basic um, body weight uh, workouts over the next few weeks probably. Disclaimer, I am by no means a personal trainer. Uh, I do this as a hobby and um, so if any of you guys have got medical um, injuries or anything like that, uh, any sort of condition, make sure that you're not going to do anything that uh, will make it unsafe for you to do so. Um, and I'll show you a couple of regressions that you can do if you're not strong enough to do, say, a full push-up, something like that. Um, but yeah, so I'll take you through what it is. So first of all will be um, push-ups, 15 push-ups, uh, body weight squats, 30 of those, Russian twists times 10 each side, so a total of 20, uh, burpees, 8 of them, and then a 3 minute rest. And then we'll be doing that for 5 rounds. Um, and then uh, make sure at the end that you properly um, cool down, uh, stretch up, and then um, also before you start, make sure you get into a good warm up. Um, Google those because I can't be bothered taking you through them. So, first of all, I'll take you through um, the correct technique for a push up. So, you want your, your thumbs pretty much on the outside of your shoulders, you want your feet can be within, hip, uh, within shoulder width apart. And then you want to move in, so you want a straight line from head to toe. Look up, because if you look down, you tend to not go down deep enough. And you want to go down until your arms are at a 90 degree angle, and then back up. It's like so. Now, if you're not strong enough to do um, a full push up, you can go down onto your knees. All right, for um, any of you who don't have the upper body strength, and do the same thing, but still keep a good straight line between uh, the top of your head and. Um, where your knees are, you want to keep it nice and stiff. You don't want to be doing this, doing this. You don't want a caterpillar going on. It's not a darts competition. Uh, body weight squats, pretty simple. Uh, you want your feet hip width apart. Ah, sorry, not hip width. Yeah, about hip width, just between your shoulders. And then you want to, you do whatever you want with your hands, but I find for balance reasons, it's easier to go out in front of you. And you want 90 degrees, pretty much. Warm up your knees because it's quite, um, it can be quite punishing if you don't warm them up properly. And you just want it to just be 30 of those. Now with that, if you need to, um, more of a challenge, get something to put on your back, something heavy. All this stuff is, once you're good at the body weight, add stuff on top of it and then uh, you'll get more out of it. Russian twists. Use whatever weight you can. This is probably too heavy. Pretty massive brick. What you want to do essentially is sit on your backside and then you want you're gonna have your feet up in the air like this. You grab your weight, and then what you do is keeping your knees and your feet still, you twist your upper body from side to side, like so. Touching the weight on either side. So it'll be 10 each side, so just count to 20 and you should be right. Next is burpee. I hate these, but they're really good. It's a full body movement and uh, gets the heart rate really going. There's a lot of different ways of doing it, but for the purpose of this workout, our burpee standard will be like so. Chest to ground. I don't care if you do a push up or not, but I generally, because of when you're doing a lot of them, you get quite tired. I usually come up onto my hips and thrust with my hips, and then you do your jump. So, bit of a technique one for that is when you're coming up off the ground if you come up instead of going onto your feet like this come up onto your feet out wide it's less distance to travel then you're using less energy but the full burpee like so eight of those then we'll move into a three minute rest after the three minute rest back into it again doesn't have to be too rushed you know make sure you're doing it safely we're gonna do that for five rounds. And once you've done that, go through your cool down. And uh, yeah, I'm gonna give it a go and um, see how it goes. All 
Alright, so that was the quarantine backyard workout number one. The only thing I'd change to it is if you're up to it, like I felt during those three minute rest, it was too long, cut it down to two minutes um, and then just add things as you go. Those um, squats are a bit of a killer and the burpees really got the heart rate up, that's why I'm sweating so much. So if you want to uh, make the squats harder, chuck some weight on your back. Um, if the push ups are too easy, do some decline push ups, you know, put your feet up on something and go hard with that. Um, stay safe out there. I know we all um, went to the supermarket and bought a whole lot of chips and biscuits for this lockdown, so try and balance it out with a bit of exercise. Um, this is just something short and simple, it's not hard. It's probably only took about 15 minutes, so um, you can obviously increase it, make it harder. Um, it's just a bit of a, something to share with you guys, it's something to work off. So um, stretch up those legs, the squats are hard, and um, also um, stretch out through the chest. Um, yeah, so. Stay safe out there guys and I'll see you for the next one.